on guys, it's Minecraft King here, and today I'm here to show you another tutorial on how to survive your first night of Minecraft. And, well, <laughs> obviously, first of all, uh, you want to get some wood right away, because, yeah, you need wood to build crafting tables and such, and all your, your first primary weapons and tools and all that, so... Usually I like to get at least two trees just to start off. And then, uh, yeah, you get two trees. And if you, uh, if you break the top leaf, like the, mi the middle leaf after under the trunk, on top of the trunk there, you actually, the tree starts falling apart by itself, which is actually kind of nice because you get saplings and such from it. So yeah, it's really awesome actually. Um, yeah, so I, like I said, I usually like to get two trees. Wood is really easy to get, you can mine it no matter what, it's just you can punch it with anything you really want. It takes a little bit longer if you don't have an axe, but uh, yeah, it's, it's it's a good thing to get. Like, also, you can also do dirt. Dirt can, uh, you can mine dirt in one, one punch, do grass, you see, look, oh, here, here we go. Here's just a sapling, see the sapling there? It's an oak sapling, and um... Yeah, see the tree just kind of falls apart. I might get some apples. I don't know. Maybe good to have some food. Um, also, you probably want to get get uh, like three sheep. You want to kill three sheep at least. You can just punch the crap out of them. It doesn't matter what color they are really. All you really want to do is just kill them and get their wool. Because when you get three wool, you can uh, make a bed. If you make a bed, you can sleep, you can survive the night just by sleeping. So, it's a lot easier than walking around trying to fend off monsters and such. So, yeah. Alright, and also, saplings are another good thing to get to when you uh, destroy trees. Because, um... Yeah, it's sap... Because you can replant the trees, you can make a wood farm and stuff like that, so... Okay, so what you want to do here is once you get all your wood... Oh, by the way, my skin really isn't working, so... Um, yeah, it's being really stupid. Oh, wait, sorry. No, <laughs> sorry, guys. You don't put the logs in the inventory. You want to get... Just take all your logs, like so. Just put them all in there, and then shift-click. Or you can just click multiple times. And then you can do that, and then you take... You just fill up that, um, little squ this little square here with oak wood planks, or whatever wood planks you got, wood, whatever you spawn in, I don't really care what it is. It could be birch wood, it could be jungle wood, it could be oak wood, it could be uh, spruce wood. It doesn't really matter what wood it is, as long as it's there. Then you can make yourself a crafting table. And, uh, yeah. Okay, so then you want to just put your crafting table down anywhere you want. It doesn't really matter because you don't really have a house yet. So, I usually like to do two, just so I can get eight sticks. It helps me out a lot. Then I can take uh, two pickaxes. Oh, nuts. Two pickaxes. Try that again. And let's make an axe as well. And we'll make a sword. Just because we can. There we go, put that sword in there. You know what? Let's make a bed as well. Just because... We knew what we we're gonna need one later. There you go. That's how you make a bed. If you guys didn't really see how I made that bed there, you guys can just either pause the video or I'll just show you right now. What you do is you take three wood planks and put them along the bottom part of your crafting table here, and then you take your three ow, and then you take your three wool and you put it on top of the top part of the crafting table, and that's how you make a bed. Um, I need my crafting table back. Do 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 do. do. Get out of here. Zombies. Oh yeah. Also, you want to kind of upgrade your your stuff, as your tools and such, quickly as possible, because if you don't do that, you're gonna. See, I'm already out of sprint. <laughs> Holy crap! That's a horde of zombies. Um. Yeah. If you guys watch my mob tutorial, you guys will know what these guys do already. That's a creep over there. Skeleton Enderman. Uh. I don't think there's any slimes, because it's not a super flat world. But, um... Ah! No, you want to stay away from these guys. Uh, yeah, I, as you can see, I'm not regening health. Unless you have full hunger, you actually don't regen health. 
which is not a very good thing to do. Um, I have no sprint. This is a problem. <laughs> I'm in a bit of trouble here, guys. Um, hopefully I don't die. That would not be pleasant. Oh, no. Please. I'm not trying to bug you. Leave me. Ow. Alright, I need to get over this mountain before I get shot to death. Alright, yeah, like I said in my uh, mobs tutorial, you if you guys get close to a skeleton, the closer you are to skeletons, the faster they will shoot at you. And <laughs> I'm trying to get as far away as possible from him. Um, I just kind of want it. You know what, zombie? You know what? You're ruining my video, zombie. Get out of here. Get Why are there so many zombies? Oh, wait, hey, you dropped an iron ingot. That's awesome. Get out of here. Stop. Oh, great. I, my sword broke. Okay, yeah. Like I said, wood swords don't last very long. And there's still a horde of zombies following me. How wonderful. Um, I need to find a place to sleep. Or just get down somewhere. Um, please leave me alone. I need to break the ground. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, please. No! Why? There has to be friggin' stone right under me, doesn't it? Alright, fine. Um, I have no sprint. This is a problem. Um, I'm surprised I'm not starving to death. That's weird. I'm not starving. That's not weird. Might be a glitch or something like that. I don't know. It tends to do that. Um... I need to get down quickly. This is how you survive your first night, guys. You just kind of make a little hidey hole. A little bit. That's what I'm kind of doing here. You make a little hide hole. And you can, uh, just do shit. <laughs> just do whatever you want. As long as you can break it. You can't really break stone with your fists, unfortunately. Why did I even bother? Oh my goodness, I am so stupid. I had a pickaxe the whole time and I could have dug down. Why did I not even think of that? I have two pickaxes to be exact. Yeah, and like I said guys, you want to upgrade your stuff as quickly as possible. Um, it's good to have stone um, items right away. I have this one iron ingot that apparently a zombie had to drop or something, I don't know. Um, a zombie just dropped a random iron ingot. Uh, yeah, I don't, know what, I don't know what's going on with that. Just, just a little random iron ingot from the zombie. Um, so yeah, as you can probably tell, there's a lot of mobs above me. If you guys can hear that or not, but they're actually, if you can't, you can't really hear that because my stupid video editing program is poop. Um, you guys can't hear that. Um, there's actually <laughs> zombies and stuff above me. I'm just going to stay in here for the time being. Um, I just gotta remember where my little hidey hole is. You can, oh, and, and by the way, guys, you can eat rotten flesh. It just gives you hunger. That's the only problem. It does give you hunger, so if you move, it'll actually take away your hunger. So try not, just try to get in your house before you eat rotten flesh, because it does give you hunger back, and it only lasts for about 20 seconds, and then it goes away. So it doesn't take very long at all. Um, I'm just gonna make myself another, make myself a stone sword here. Yeah. So honestly, guys, it really doesn't take all that long. I'm pretty sure. Wait a minute. That's not even. Yes, I can build ladders. Gonna make some ladders. Six ladders now. If you guys didn't see that, this this is the crafting recipe for them. You just kind of make an H with sticks. Really simple. Just make an H with sticks. If I can actually click on my there we go. <laughs> um, yeah, it's ladders. You only make them out of wood. You can't really make them out of anything else, unfortunately. Um, that actually gave me more sticks, so I'm actually gonna use those to my advantage. Makes myself a pickaxe. Yay! Alright, I got myself a new pickaxe. I actually want to keep my wood one in there, I didn't go there. I don't really need a new axe. I already need some wood though. 
that seems to be a problem. Um, yeah, yeah, I can sleep. Okay, guys. Um, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, guys, that's pretty well it for surviving your first night. Um, you don't have to make a bed. You can't go with your, like, adventurous action. Um, you can do whatever you darn well please. I really don't care either way. Um, I don't really care if you don't make a bed or not. It's ideal for me. Yeah, it's just, it's just an ideal thing for me, just to make a bed, because I'm going to travel around here so I know where I'm going. Right? There go. Yeah, she's sitting by my house. Um, so yeah, that's, as I said, that's pretty much your first night of Minecraft. Um, Another thing you might want to do, if you do make a pickaxe right away, try to find some coal, because then you can get some, you, know, you already have some wood stuff, so you can get some coal, like that stuff over there. If you get the coal, then, uh, yeah, then you can make, uh, some torches, and you can light up your little hut thing. And, um, yeah, guys, that's pretty well it. If you like the commentary, and you like what I do, leave a like, subscribe, and, uh, check out my channel. And also, um, leave a comment down in the description below whether you guys think I should keep doing these tutorials and such. And, um, yeah, this is Minecraft King saying, see you later, everybody, and don't forget to live like a king, guys. Terminate.